My name is Daystar Peterson, aka Tory Lanez, and this is my one day documentary. <laughs> and this right here is a deeper look into my life right now. <laughs> yes, sir. You know, this what's going out to all my see that girls, baby. <laughs> What it look like, Rams? <laughs> Money for y'all of the France and South. Still at hotels that we can't pronounce. <laughs> yeah, I like the blue jay fitted and all that. You know, with the Gabbana shades, the Dior bag. Hey, girls. Woo! Boy, Lane. Remember that day? So, return. I had to get it this. It's actually funny how I actually started rapping. Playing a game of Madden. I was losing. I was losing to my cousin. My cousin, my older cousin, got so mad. After the game, I went into the garage. I started writing mad rhymes. And I was just cursing them out because I couldn't fight them, you know what I'm saying? Like, one thing that really influenced me to do music, I would have to say, was the passing of my mom. See, the thing about my mom is my mom, she was anemic. And she had a, a disease that only a four out of one million get a year. It was crazy because one day she was sick and then I woke up next morning and came back from school. You know what I mean? In the afternoon she was gone. You know what I mean? So I gotta be paying attention to the whole world and what's going on everywhere so that I could be a worldwide artist. So I could be somebody who's international, someone who lives a legacy. I couldn't have other people write for me. I write all of my songs. I write all of my melodies. I write all of my rhymes. I can't have somebody else write from my perspective. It doesn't make sense because it's not something that I know is going to touch you that came from my heart. You know what I mean? Maybe that was somebody else's story. But if it's not my story, I can't deliver it. That's me. Canada. The way Sean found me was actually on YouTube. He was like, wow, this kid has energy. You know what I mean? He looked further into me, seen my singing, and he was like, you know what I mean? You recognize the true talent in me, and you seen what I had. And he had actually hit me up like February of uh, 2010. And he was like, yo, bro, I would love to do music with you. I would love to highlight you on some business. Like, you know what I mean? I would love to do some business with you. And he said he was coming to Toronto on the Justin Bieber tour, the first leg of the tour. And I met up him and Justin Bieber. I performed. Ever since then, we've just been keeping in contact with each other and just making sure that we just both on the same page. You know what I'm saying? With them beads around my neck like I'm fresh out the village. This bus right here, my man Sean. Y'all know what it is. Swag relief in the normal whip, sitting in the passenger seat. This is the guy right here, so we're working on some new stuff right now. Guy. He's the next superstar, man. We're plotting a lot of new stuff with him right now. Time is money. We, we got, we got, we got uh, one ver Mr. One Verse Killer coming out. Make sure y'all looking for that. That's just going to be a little warm up. Then we got the real thing, Mr. Peterson. You don't want to miss out on that. If you don't get that, you're not on, you're not on earth. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Right now, we on the tour. Justin Bieber tour, Sean Kingston. Right now, fans are just getting in their seats and everything. I can take y'all backstage. Y'all come to me. Yeah, it's T Lane's. I co signed this dude right here, my nigga Connect. You know what I mean? World's best dancer slash choreographer. He killing the game right now. Y'all, I'm gonna let you introduce yourself. You can introduce yourself. So, how you doing? It's a Mount Boy Connect out of Bronx, New York, right now. We on the Bieber tour. I dance for Justin Bieber, dance for choreographer. How I met T Lanes was before I met T Lanes. I was in Japan. I was in Japan going to the airport after doing a TV show with Justin. And end up listening to this whole kid's album on the iTunes. Like, yo, who's this kid? Talking, talking, thinking every day. By next week, I'm talking to him about his raps and didn't know that was him. That's T Lane. T Lane is everywhere. You don't have to meet him to know him. Hey, yo, Sean, you and Mr. Kingston. I'm about to hit the stage right now, man. I'm pumped up right now. Tory Lane's in the house. 
second artist. Montreal, let's go! No, no, no. I'm feeling like you let it go. Before I'm about to go up on the show, he gonna do fire burning. He said right after fire burning to be in the back. I never really get on the stage before. <laughs> Yo, first performance. I'm ready, baby. Super thing. I did in the sun in the south for Spain. Got me soon as I walk through the door. Oh, my pockets are the thicker lane. The way she dropped it on that thing. You guys gotta get ready for this guy. You guys gotta, you guys gotta make some noise because he's from Toronto. He's representing Toronto. Are you guys ready for Toronto's song, Tory Lanez? Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Tory, where you at? Tour life is it's, at first, it's like, whoa, everything's coming so fast. You might go to sleep while the bus is driving, and then you'll like wake up and like not know where you are, not know what time it is, not know what day of the week it is. Whatever beat he could jump on, he could just make it his own. And that's what I like about an artist that could just own the beat.